Welcome to Makeup Posse. Welcome to July Favorites. I thought we'd go over some of the things I've been enjoying this month. First of all, I've got uh, something most of us probably do have that we've been enjoying, and that's the Jergens Natural Glow. That product, I have it in a trial size, so that made the product a little cheaper, and I've used it almost daily. Um, it just adds more, a little bit moisturizer, coloring to your uh, routine. And I usually end up when I, I wear this when I do a bronze look. And it, the, the small size runs like three to four dollars. And also, believe it or not, with that item, I wear this, and yes, I wear this on my face. Um, the air, the, Sally Hansen airbra Airbrush Legs. Um, it's great for your legs, but it's also great for your face if mixed correctly. Um, I may do a video if it interests you guys on this and doing the mix for the face. Um, but I usually mix it with the Jergens. And um, also, usually with a BB cream. Depending on... If I want it real dark or real light, I can adjust the amount I use. But I pretty much just use a small amount with all the other items. Okay, and I've been loving that. And because of the summer and the heat, I've been using my Revlon Age Defying Makeup, the liquid. And I thoroughly, thoroughly love this for summertime. It just keeps my face moisturized. Uh, and it has SPF 15. And... I think this is, it, it averages depending on where you can locate the product, but it runs anywhere from 5 to $9. Okay, uh, and the next product surprised me. So, uh, I don't know if any of you guys have bought it yet, but this, the e.l.f. Uh, Little Black Beauty book, the one we done a, um, a tutorial on. Uh, what I, I've been wearing a lot of the vibrant colors for summer out of it and like for today for example I'm wearing the corals and they have surprised me with the pigment and the amount of last that they've had so I've been pleasantly surprised and this little guy was just six dollars and not again uh, you may want to see uh, go back and watch the review I've done on the product because not every eyeshadow in here is really good quality. But for the money, for what you do get, I like it. Okay. And I've got some high-end products this month, guys. Um, yes, I do use high-end products on occasion. Primarily, though, I stick to low, low-cost, low, low-key low products. Just like, for example, with these products. I buy higher-cost items. I usually find at a sale price or a trial size size depending on how much use I will get out of the product for example I buy this new every year I don't keep it and reuse it reuse it reuse it that's why I don't want to I don't want a big size um, but anyway guys this is a product um, that I've been loving of course it does not matter you do not have to have this particular product I just prefer if I'm Especially going shopping for the day, going out for the day, due to the heat and stuff. I like to use an eye primer in the summertime especially. And this one is a higher cost eye primer. It is from the UK. It is Mica. It runs about $20. Um, and like I said, you do not have to use this eye primer. Um, I just I think most eye primers will, will do the job in the summertime. Um just buy as high quality of one as you can find and afford and the next thing i've been loving you guys have been loving i know you have um may not be the same brand and again i probably am going to try the nyc next time because i i'm the only person on the planet that's probably not tried the nyc bronzer and sunny it is dirt cheap um the e.l.f. one is a little too dusty for me. It's a dirt cheap also. This particular one is a little bit more expensive. 
but I loved it, loved it for the money. It's from Pop Beauty. It was $12 in Secret Sunshine. And as you can tell, I hit pan. And I only had this probably since May, April maybe. And I've, I've used it almost daily. And I do, do love this thing. And especially when I'm going for a bronze look. Love bronzer. Love it. Alright, the next product I've been loving has to go along with... Um, well, I, I decided to save that one for the next one. What I actually have been loving, every one of you guys are going to be surprised, I think. If you've not discovered it yet, you're in for a treat. I have discovered for a great, great eyebrow color for me with dark hair is in the LA Colors Sunflower palette, which is like a dollar fifty or two dollars for the entire palette okay the reason I, I hit pan here is I dropped it that's the only problem with these products uh, the low cost isn't from the quality of the product necessarily but the packaging and uh, once dropped yours could look like this too or worse <laughs> but anyway the product that I've been using with my eyebrows to shade is this color it doesn't have an individual name, but it looks gold in the palette, um, but it comes off as a dark brown, and it has been doing wonders. I'm actually letting them grow out, so you can't see a whole lot about them, but I'm wearing this today, and pleasantly, pleasantly happy with this. I use a, uh, a dark eyeliner underneath the bottom and then I fill in with this easily done if you want to see how it's done just like leave a comment and we'll do a video on that I'm easy to get along with guys I'll do what you guys need okay uh, the next thing I've been loving which did go with that uh, a lot of the bronzy looks the coral looks and stuff I have been uh, using browns dark browns a lot more has to do with my age as well um and i've really been enjoying this dark brown eyeliner this is from pacifica again you do not have to purchase an expensive eyeliner at all um this one i think runs for like eleven dollars i am a huge huge fan of jordana eyeliners lip liners uh they are at walgreens and they run I think a dollar and ninety nine. Uh, they are retractable. They are wonderful. If I had one, I'd probably use it over this one. Um, the next thing I have been loving has been my my blush, which it is an expensive blush. Um, it's from Model Company um, in Peach Bellini. I've got to show you the color, though, guys. I got to show you. Isn't that gorgeous for summer with bronze skin? Oh my gosh. Um, but anyway, it's Peach Bellini, $8.99. You can find an alternative. Like I said, anything high-end or a little more expensive, I have found on sale. Or it came in an Ipsy bag for like $10 a month subscription. Super cheap. Uh, I don't pay big prices for hardly anything. I'm a, I'm a bargain hunter. Uh... Okay, and the absolutely next thing I've been loving is it did come in an Ipsy bag and so that was within a $10 range with other products. But this retails, this it's a highlighter and I've been using it daily. Um, it is Vintage Cosmetics. It retails for like $26. And uh, I do love it though. I do. I will honestly try to always find this highlighter. It will go with pink. It will go with uh, coral. It is lovely, lovely in the summertime. Okay, and <laughs> I have to say the thing. I Now we're getting into my very, very favorite things for July. Absolutely. Cannot do without. Cannot live without. Gotta have. Don't matter where I'm at. My dark shades. I've got to have these babies. I just see better. I can look around. I mean, 
I'm not getting glare off of everything. I love my dark glasses, the prescription strength. Love them. I would sleep in these if I could uh, without damaging them because I love these glasses. Um, and for summer, for July, sunglasses are a must have, even for the smallest of, of children, in my opinion. I've also been loving my um, baby lips. I do tend to wear more lip uh, balms in July than any other time all year round. Uh, I wear chapsticks, of course, in the in the winter, and that's when I tend to wear my balms the most is in the winter. Uh, but in July, that's what I wear almost every day. And guys, the next thing I've been loving this month is this my car keys because it got. I do have a car. I'm thankful I have a car. Not everyone has a car. Most everyone does, but not everyone. And for those of us who are fortunate enough to have a car and are able to ride around with the windows down or the top down in July, that is a favorite thing year after year. I've never grown tired of it. Don't care if I do look like a wild woman. Love it, love it, love it. All my friends know. If you're traveling with me, you can expect those windows to go down at some point because summertime, windblown hair, gotta love it. My most favorite things this month, guys, is special shout out to my friends, spending time with my friends. I hope you guys have been spending time with your friends because we tend to take those closest to us for granted and we're fortunate enough through the year, most of us, to get to see our family, spend time with them. But our friends sometimes are neglected. I hope you've made time sometime at least through the summer or before the summer is over to spend time with your friends. Uh, if you can't visit them, make long distance calls to them. They are an important part of who you are. They have made a difference in 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 everything to you. They helped you through the hardest days, the longest days, as well. I hope you have helped them. And uh, I have got to give a special shout out to my besties. I love you. There's no words for what you guys have done for me through the years. I could never repay you guys enough for all you give back to me. I adore you. I love you. And I want you to know I think about you guys each and every one every single day. And I hope you guys, somewhere in your busy lives, think of me. Um, special shout out. Hi, Chris. Love you, baby. Uh, hi, Ellie. <laughs> I know you're watching. Uh, had a great time the other day. I can't wait for us to get to go off and about again. I love you much. Uh, Teresa. I haven't got to see you as much as I've wanted to, but we've shared a lot of heartfelt talks of late, and you know I love you. You know I'll do anything for you. I want to spend some time with you. When are we going to do that? I do want to do that. I've enjoyed our talks, so absolutely loved getting back in touch. And Kim, where are you, girlfriend? You know I love you. Uh, I'm here. And I'm not here. Uh, I started to say, I'm here, come see me, but you never know. You better call and check. Um, and, of course, I'm down your way, but on the run, limited time, that kind of thing. I do miss you. I do think about you. And, girl, I check out as much Facebook as I can. I'm not on there much in the summer, though, I have to admit. But I keep up with you vicariously on there. And I feel like you're still with me every day. I love you much. You know that. You know that you're with me, inbred in me. There you are. Um, oh my gosh! I've recently seen these other two friends, and they both are a blessing to me each in different ways. And that's uh, Janet. I love you. Love our text time. Love our talk time. Love our FaceTime. I just want you to know you are a blessing to me and a godsend. So, I thank you for everything you do. Looking forward to our dinner out. And I uh, hope to have some girl time soon. Alright. And Barbara, last but not least. Or maybe least, okay? 
I just want to do a shout out to you as one of my favorite people. I'm glad that um, you and Ellie got to meet this month. And I don't know what to say about you. I owe my life almost to you. But uh, I have missed us talking as much as we used to did. But it was fantastic to get to see you. You're still in my heart. I still love you very much. Uh, you'll always be a part of me. Uh, you're my little angel that got me back on my feet. Uh, and I love you and I thank God for you all the time. But each and every one of you, Chris, Ellie, Teresa, Kim, Janet, Barbara, you have made a difference in my life. And I want you to know there's not a day that I don't think of you guys. And you're part of my favorite things for July and every other day. All right, guys. And my subbies out there, I'm beginning to love you guys. Just checking in, just knowing you're there. It, it makes me feel good. I see you on Twitter. I see you on Instagram. Um, I just know you're there keeping up with me. And, and Google Plus, I see all of you girls on Google Plus. And guys, Wayne, I see you too. All right. And um, I appreciate the support, guys. I hope to get better at what I'm doing. This is brand new to me. But I love makeup. And I'm going to be doing some tutorials that will help each of us based on our age groups coming up in the foreseeable future. And so us oldies will get our attention, but so will the younger folks. So if you feel free to, to come and follow me and see what I know about beauty products, high end, low end, see if I can save you some money, I'll try. Uh, please do. And give me a thumbs up, like on any video that you'd, you've watched and you do like. Just go back and click that thumb. And um, also, please subscribe. It does help me. And in turn, I can help you and be able to be here more for you, depending on the number of subs I can, I can get. And my subs, of course, is subscribers. And uh, you guys are family. I appreciate all the viewership already. And all the text time. I, I, I just love hearing from you guys. Alright. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful rest of the day. And have a fabulous week. And I hope to have another video up soon. Love you guys. Bye.